Hi, YouTube. I'm now 28 weeks pregnant, which makes me seven months. Um, so I don't have like too much to go over for this week because not, not really had a lot has changed. Like, I don't really have a lot of symptoms, like, just mostly the same. Um, so I guess I tell you guys my symptoms and just tell you what's new and the baby shower and stuff like that and my appointments. Okay, so I've been having still a lot of low, um, sore back pain. I'm going to look at my journal so you can't see me looking now. Um, I have sore feet, like the bottom of my feet, it'd be like really sore. Um, I've been cramping a lot, like on and off. Um, my stomach popped out, as you guys can see. Um, my breast has been sore, like, this is the first time during my whole pregnancy. Well, I've been sore before, but not this sore, like. To the point that if it irritates when I shower. Um, I only gained it, gained it five pounds during this whole pregnancy, um, which is good. The doctor said it's fine. Um, cravings. I really just have been have been craving a lot of sweet food, like anything that's sweet. I eat it. Um. TJ, he moves around so much now, like, it's crazy, like, I feel he moves all day long. I get big kicks, I get rolls, I get everything. So, yeah, he moves, he moves when I touch my stomach or when I just randomly just poke my stomach or just rub it on it. He'll kick my hand or punch my hand, whatever he's doing, because he's still breached. I mean, I'm not sure. My last appointment, that was 22 weeks, and he still was breached. My last ultrasound. So, I see. I have an appointment on tomorrow. I have an appointment tomorrow to see. They're, since I have diabetes, they have to constantly check his weight and make sure he's not getting over big or too big, put it like that. So, I have an appointment tomorrow. I have an ultrasound tomorrow. Um, they're going to check his weight and see where he is, like, if his weight is on, on the right schedule or he's too big or too small. So, yeah, the doctor says they're going to be checking that a lot now, like, so I, I start my appointments are now, like, I think I go once a week or twice a week. I go a lot because I have diabetes and I have to constantly check my sugars, like, make sure it's not high. So, that's really, like, ugh, I'm sick of going, I'm sick of seeing these people. <sighs> I want to get sleep and my appointments be so early. I have to wake up tomorrow at 6 o'clock. Oh, it's my next appointment. Um... So the insulin, I'm doing really good with the insulin. My sugar has not been too high. It's helping, but I just guess they got to um change the dose again. Um I tell you, I have an appointment tomorrow. Check all that. Um, my last appointment. Did I tell you guys my last appointment? No. They just check my sugars mostly. And I had to give blood work. It's just since I'm in the third trimester, they had to get blood work, so Got blood work. They say if I was a diabetic, they would have gone ahead and text, tested me for um gestational diabetes. But since I already have it, I don't have to get tested for it. Cause I heard the juice or whatever you drink is very nasty. But guess I won't find out. <laughs> but um, my baby shower is February the eleventh. Um, I sent out the invitations, so the invitations are out, um, you know, my sister, or well, my sister, it's my sister, my mother-in-law, my mother, and my cousin, my husband, cousin, they're playing the baby shower, and my sister just tell me parts of what's going on, because she won't tell me nothing, she don't pay for nothing, so I'm like, cool, okay, um, 
but so far my theme is going to be a jungle theme and i will try to put up pictures or a video because our camera like something something is wrong with like it's like our battery soon put batteries and it, it'll go dead so i don't know if i'm going to record it i really want to i might buy a new one i really want to buy a new camera so i might we have a brand new camera let me show you guys this camera right here but for some reason the battery won't last even because we have a battery charger and it still doesn't work so i have no clue what's wrong with the camera but there's no baby buys for this week i'm not buying nothing else until after the baby shower because yeah i have to, me and my husband well mostly me went crazy on just buying things like so i'm just wait i'm gonna try to wait <laughs> But um, we're getting the crib and the dresser. I already have a changing table. Um, we're getting the crib and the dresser. Um, the first week in February. Um, we get the car seat in the or the travel system. We get that um, the baby shower, and I get the basket. I get all this stuff on the baby shower. So. I'm just excited. I can't. I'm so excited for baby shower. See what it's like. I passed out a lot of invitations, so I know it's going to be packed, including my family, his family, and friends. It's, I'm just so excited to see how it turns out. I'm so ready for the food. <laughs> but, um, oh yeah. So, I, as I told you guys, I, I do plan on breastfeeding, and I'm not really sure on what breast pump to use, or any bottles to use, or if you can use, because a lot of people tell me different stuff. I don't know if you use pacifiers, or a lot of people say you can't use pacifiers because it's confusing with the nipples, but then again, they have nipples, I mean pacifiers, that's shaped kind of like the nipple, so I'm not sure. So, any of you guys that's breastfeeding and having breast pump, electric breast pump, I don't want to use the hand one. I, I heard that it hurts really bad, so I don't want to use the hand one. I want to use the electric um pump. So, any of you guys know a good brand and one that works really well, I don't really care about the price. I just want a good brand. So, anyone that knows a really good one, um... Please let me know, because I really, really, I've been asking everyone. i just been getting so many different answers, and I try to, I research some, and some people say it's good, some people say it's not, so I have no clue. <laughs> um, what else? Oh, for some reason, like, it's another symptom. Ever since I got pregnant, like, my lips has been, like, in a pill, like, in a pill constantly. And I read somewhere that was the um, pregnancy symptom. <sighs> but I'm still out of breath all the time. Oh, my God. All the time. To the point, like I told my doctor, and I was like, well, we already did, like, it did a, um, what is it called? A heart scan or whatever to see what's going on. But they did, they redid it again because I told her that with me even just sitting here or just sitting in bed, I'd be like, <gasps> I be gasping for breath for no reason. I'm not even doing nothing. So, yeah. I guess I find out um, Monday, tomorrow. So, it's not really much to talk about. I cannot wait. It's like, ugh. I cannot wait. I want my baby boy to be here already. And I will be making, um, I'm not, I'm still debating because I really don't want to put him all on a camera like everyone around the world is staring at my baby. But <laughs> I don't know. I'm still just trying to kind of, uh, I don't know. So what do you guys think? Like, I know some mothers are funny about it, but I'm still like stuck. Like, should I put him on or I might just show him like in my labor, labor and delivery video. But other than that, I'm, I'm going to do updates, but I might not show him in the video. Because I'm not, I don't feel too safe putting him on YouTube. Like, I just don't. I'm just, I know I'm going to be very protective over him. Like, this is, oh my God. I already am now. When somebody try to touch my stomach, it's like, hold on, what you doing? When I'm in the store, 
because people uh, push the um, carts around. They'll just come out the aisle and they'll see my big stomach. They'll see it. And they'll still come flying around the corner, almost hit me with the cart. And I'm like, I'll push the cart back. Like, you probably hit me in my stomach. But, yeah. I'm sorry, but it's like, I don't know. I don't want you guys to think, oh, she did all of this for so long. So I'm about, when the baby finally gets her, she don't make videos. I'm still going to make videos, but I don't know if I'm going to put him in it. I might show pictures, but I don't know. I'm still thinking about it. My husband might not be too comfortable with me putting him on the internet. So I don't know, you guys. I have to think about it. But I will show you guys pictures and stuff of him. But, um, so yeah, so please comment and let me know. What you guys think about the breast pump, what is good, pacifier, anything that I'm going to need when he's first here. Like, the most important stuff I need. Because I'm still kind of like, oh, okay, I see other people getting this, but a lot of people get unnecessary stuff. So, please, guys, if you had a baby or if you had a baby and you know, please comment and let me know because I'm stuck. So, I show you guys my belly. My 28-week big belly. And I will see you guys in my 29 week update. Excuse the mess in the back. We still haven't started on the nursery yet. But we will start on the nursery um after the baby shower. My belly. As you can see, my belly is huge. Like when people see me, they're like, oh my god, never like when people like went, like in church and stuff, like when they saw me before, they didn't really know that I was pregnant. They see me now, it's like, oh my god, that's why you use the bathroom so much. Uh, yeah. <sighs> my belly. Excuse me for what I have on. I just, I wore this to church today and I just put, I went to sleep and I just put some pajama pants on. I didn't really. <laughs> yeah, so I will see you guys in my, what is it? <laughs> uh, what is it? 29 week update. Thank you guys for watching and please, 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 please comment and let me know because I will, I'm really just stuck <laughs> on what to get. Thank you guys again for watching my videos and going through my journey with me. I will see you guys next week. Okay, have a blessed day. Bye.